Hey everybody, I'm Lisa Roberry, your independent Scentsy consultant. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is an exciting one because my flash sale goodies are here. I am super, super excited. One thing I love about when my flash sale orders arrive um, is that typically I forget what I order. <laughs> so it's kind of like Christmas happens. You're just like totally forgot what I ordered. So it's just like you're experiencing it for the first time. Like you didn't intentionally order everything. It's fantastic. Um, one thing I do want to say before we dive into this haul is that um, Sensi is still working feverishly um, to ship all of these orders out. So just know that if you have not yet received your flash sale order, Sensi is still working on them. Um, as I had mentioned in my flash sale video and as Sensi had a little banner at the top of the page, um, Sensi can take up to 21 business days, which does not include weekends or holidays, to ship these orders. I know a lot of people have already received their orders and people are starting to receive their orders, but just know that if you have not yet received your orders just yet, Sensi is still working tirelessly around the clock to get these orders shipped and on the way to you. So with all of that being said, I did just receive my flash sale goodies. So of course I wanted to do a flash sale haul with you guys. Um, the, let's, let's just talk for a minute. I, I'm here for a good deal. Like I'm, I'm always here for a good deal. Um, some flash sales are better than others. And I feel like the last few have been really like, since he has knocked it out of the park for sure. And they have offered warmers, they have offered bar bundles. I mean, and we're talking deep, deep discounts. There were some bars that were under $2 each. There were bars that were under $4 each. Like it, it was amazing, like up to 70% off on a lot of these products. With all of that being said, the flash sale did not last the full 24 hours. Um, as I mentioned in that video, announcing the flash sale. Um, Sensi anticipates the sale to last for 24 hours, but when the deals are so, so good, a lot of times we buy up all of the things, <laughs> which means they are not able to run the sale for the full 24 hours. So that was the case here. I will say that this flash sale did last longer than the than the sale before um the flash sale before this one that just happened it only lasted like five or six hours this one lasted a good majority of the day um don't get me wrong there were things that were selling out nothing was actually pulled from my cart surprisingly enough um and you'll see what i i, I went in twice <laughs> i went in twice um but nothing nothing was pulled from my cart so i'm i'm happy about that um i know there were some hiccups with the queue system and the timing and things what, what was kind of wonky but um nothing was pulled from my cart and i feel like it was a relatively smooth launch um i went in the first time had my larger order that we're going to dive into and then i went in a second time i always go in a couple of times for flash sales because what happens is for me, when I go in in that initial like shop, I'm looking and I'm just like, I'm grabbing. I'm like, okay, I need this bundle. I need this bundle. I need this bar. I need this, you know, whatever it is. Um, and then I check out so that way I get those items and then whew, I take a deep breath and then I go back in and then I calmly look at everything. <laughs> Because then when I'm calmly looking at things, um, I, tem I tend to see things that I didn't see the first time. And so then I'll usually be like, oh, wait, hey, I didn't see that before. I need that in my life. Or that's a really good deal. Or, or I was looking at something and I was like, oh, I don't think I need it. I'm good. Nah, yeah, I, nah, I'm good. And then I go back and I'm like, yeah, it's still here. So I think I need it. <laughs> So, um, and so sometimes I'll go in two times. Sometimes I'll go in three times. I don't think I usually go in more than three times. Um, but yeah, so, so with this flash sale, I went in twice. So we have that. So we've got two boxes here. The first box we're going to dive into is the smaller box, which means this is my second order from the flash sale. Um, it's, it's just, it's a little guy. <laughs> it's just, it's a little one, but, um, nonetheless, I still got, still got some deals so I am here for it so um so yes this, <laughs> this these were bars that I was like I was looking at and I was thinking oh should I when with the initial order and thinking oh should I should I should I yeah 
I'm not going to. And then I went back in and I was like, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. So I grabbed some bars of Atlantic Air. So Atlantic Air, really, really nice, pretty, fresh, clean scent. So I grabbed four of these bars and I'm glad I did um, because I what here's what was happening. So I was going through and I was kind of like, I don't want to say necessarily panic buying because otherwise there will be a lot more here. But, um, you know, just I was just thinking, what if this one's not going to come back? So, oh, and it's so, so pretty. Um, this is really, really nice. Like I said, just fresh and clean. This was a really, really good performer. And I just love this. So I picked up four bars of Atlantic Air during the flash sale. Super, super happy I did. Um, the other bar. So this one I specifically remember looking at with my initial order and it is the Evil Queen Just One Bite. So I have three bars of the Evil Queen inspired scent. Um, and this is a really good apple spice scent really really nice i love this definitely not going to be warming it until the fall time um but this is definitely one that i do really enjoy i did actually have this added to my cart with my initial order and this was one that i was like Ugh. okay i don't when i was getting ready to check out i was like okay i don't need all of these things so then i wound up like this i wound up removing them and then i went back in and they were still there <laughs> so i was like Okay, I guess this is a sign. They're still there. Let me just go ahead and pick up a few bars uh, because it is a scent that I do really, really enjoy. So Evil Queen, just one bite. I've got a good little apple spice scent ready to go for the fall time when the time comes. So there's that. Okay, and then I also saw the Chase Rainbows Blue Bar that was in the flash sale love this scent this is not one that wound up going into my club i don't think um chase rainbows red and orange absolutely um but this one i just i wound up not adding it just because it's since does a really good fresh clean scent and they there's there's nothing that's like super different about this scent i want to say like it's really good and it's a fantastic performer um but there's just there's a lot of other scents that are very similar to this so i just feel like my club is out of control you guys you already know <laughs> if you have seen the scentsy club edits with me you you have seen my club and i don't need help with adding bars to my club for sure so um uh, but this i it's it's lovely <laughs> it's lovely i saw it was on sale so i was just like you know what i'm gonna go ahead and snag six bars of this so i went ahead and grabbed six bars of the chase rainbows blue bar it was a great deal i love the scent it's a fantastic performer it's not in my club so it was like perfect done so i grabbed six bars here <laughs> so good there so that was my second order that i went in and grabbed um just a few more things that I don't know either what weren't there before i think the chase rainbow is blue I, I didn't see that one before um atlantic air i saw just one bite i saw but then when i came back and they were still there i thought okay i guess i need these <laughs> so i went ahead and added those so that was the second flash sale order for myself now let's go ahead and dive into the first flash sale order that went through that day Okay, and now on to the larger box and my initial flash sale order. Let's go ahead and see. And I, I did some damage. <laughs> so you can see why when I go through um, and I go to check out and I see what's in my cart and I'm thinking, okay, we got to pare this down just a little bit. But then I don't, I don't know why I do that to myself because then I still go in a second time and I, I still pick the things that I removed out of my cart. So it's really, it's kind of silly, but one of those things okay what do we have here so we have oh yes, yes 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 so i went ahead and picked up a counter clean in coconut lemongrass love 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 our counter clean um i i have a few more counter cleans um there's a really good deal you can do a bundle of three counter cleans which is a really good deal um but since this was in the flash sale i was like i'm gonna go ahead and pick this up 
You guys, if you have not tried Scentsy's Counter Clean, it is literal magic in a bottle. It is fantastic. I use it on pretty much everything. Um, you, it goes way far beyond countertops, you guys. <laughs> like I have used this on shoes. I have used it on carpets. I have used it on rugs, on couches, on vehicles. Like you can use it on all of the things and it will get stains out like nobody's business. Like it's amazing. I absolutely love our counter clean. So grabbed it in coconut lemongrass. I also grabbed our all purpose cleaner concentrate in coconut lemongrass. And one of the questions I get all the time is, well, what's the difference? This is a, an all purpose cleaner concentrate clearly. So, um, you will get multiple bottles out of this container because it's concentrated. So you will do a mixture, um, in a spray bottle and you will use it that way. Um, what I used to do now here in this house, the counter clean works great on our countertops in our old house. Um, it would leave a lot of streaking on our countertops. So I actually hated this for the counters. I used it on everything else, but I did not use it on my countertops. Here in this house, for whatever reason, I don't know if it's because it's quartz countertops here or what, but um, I actually do use the counter clean on our countertops here. Um, but the all purpose cleaner, I actually was like my go-to for our countertops in our old house with the granite. Um, it just worked better for me. I don't know if it was just the ratio, the diluting. I, I don't know what it is. It just, it worked better. Now here in this house, since I'm using the counter clean on the countertops, all purpose cleaner for the win for hardwood floors. Oh, good gracious. <laughs> this stuff is amazing. I love this for our hardwood floors. I mop with it and I will tell you, our floors looked way better when I started using this on our hardwood floors than even when we moved in. This is a brand new house and our floors have looked so dang good whenever I use this to mop our floors. It's fantastic. So I cannot say good enough good stuff about our all-purpose cleaner. Like I said, especially if you've got hardwood floors, use this to mop with. Oh man, it's a game changer. Fantastic. So saw it in the flash sale, was like, yep, I'm gonna take that. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have a plethora of bars here, you guys. Like a plethora. Uh, they they had these uh, different 10 bar bundles that were really, really good prices. So let's go ahead. I don't know what bundle this was in. And it's not a complete bundle because there's only six here and we've got a whole nother box that's gonna be filled with bars. So I guess we'll just go ahead and start with these bars. <laughs> and then I think we've got a couple more things and then we'll dive into the other box of bars. So um, first bar here we're gonna talk about is Darling Dahlia. And this is a really pretty sweet floral. I remember this one and it's so nice. Gosh, I love this one. Really, really nice. So Darling Dahlia we have here. I'm gonna go through this kind of quick because we have an actual ton of bars <laughs> to talk about here. Flower Child, another beautiful, sweet floral. This one's actually in my club. It'll stay there forever. This is just, ah, I love it. So good, sweet floral. Another one that's in my club is Love and Happiness. I think this one was like, there was like a, a love bundle, I think. I think that's what these were. Darling Dahlia, Flower Child love and happiness. Mm, love and happiness is absolutely beautiful as well. Um, very perfumey floral. It might be a little bit too much for some people, but I love this. It's fantastic. Uh, Pacific Daydream. This one, I think there was like a spa bundle or something, or uh, I don't remember, but this was, I think more of a fresh bundle, I think but this one's really nice. This one was actually a scent of the month like a hundred years ago. And um, this one's, it's a really nice, just fresh, really nice fresh scent. So very nice. We have Pacific Daydream, My Only Sunshine. And this one's in my club as well. This is another um, just sweet floral, really pretty. I'm gonna be totally set for the springtime. Like I am not gonna lie. I'm kind of already in like spring mode when it comes to my home fragrance. I am just, I'm feeling it. I am feeling the spring type scents. <laughs> and so this is just, this is perfect. This scent, Accidentally in Love. I do remember this one, I miss it. It has been years, I think, since this one's been available. Ugh, this one's so nice. Accidentally in Love, this is like a cherry lime scent. 
Um, it's sweet, but you have the tartness from the lime, kind of like, I, what I really like about these types of scents, like rainbow sherbet and things like that, and cherry limeade, is that you have the sweetness, but then the acid from the lime just kind of cuts through it, so it's not too cloying, and it's just really, really good. So I love this one, Accidentally in Love. So that is the first six bars from, <laughs> from the original flash sale order. And then we have a hand soap. <laughs> we have a hand soap in Appleberry. Love it, love it, love it. Um, as you guys know, if you are new here on my channel, hello and welcome. I hope you'll stick around. You will find out that I am a foaming hand soap girl. <laughs> So I actually don't prefer this type of hand soap. Um, I don't prefer the liquid hand soap. I prefer it foaming. So what I'll do is I'll actually dilute this down. I have some foaming hand soap dispensers. And so what I will do is I'll actually split this into two different dispensers um, and just split it in half. And then uh, as long as you have the foaming hand soap dispenser, mix it with water, boom, you have your Scentsy hand soap and it is foaming at that point. So love that. So we've got that in Appleberry. And then now we have a box inside a box with more bars. Okay, so let's see what bars we have. And oh my gosh, this is just like one of the best sights ever. <laughs> when you just open up a box and you see nothing but bars. It's fantastic. Okay, so let's see what bars we have. And keep in mind, they had some special flash sale 10 bar bundles. So um, I, I don't remember what all of the different bundles were. So um, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna read off what these, uh, what these bars are. So from the Find Your Happy Wax Collection, Taste of Summer. This one is in my club, but it is fantastic. Um, this is a sweet lemon tea. I love good tea scents and since he does a great tea scent we had originally had a like southern sweet tea that one was just not strong for me whatsoever this one it's strong this one's really strong and i love it so taste of summer we also have sweet but fierce this one was from the glamorous you collection this one was a really good collection as well um this one not my favorite scent but that's okay it's it's pretty but um i'll enjoy it but not one that like i have missed or anything like that but who knows that's kind of the fun part about doing these different uh 10 bar bundles that scentsy like creates for us um you may find a scent that you're like oh you know that was fine but it wasn't anything super spectacular and then when you get it and you warm it you're like wait a minute this is kind of amazing <laughs> so that will happen sometimes too so sweet but fierce who knows we'll see be fabulous there's some of these that i'm gonna be like oh be fabulous is one that did not make it into the spring and summer catalog that is coming up in march and um, we're gonna do a whole video series on what scents are coming back what scents are not coming back all of the things um i am happy to say that not all of the scents from the flash sale did not make it back. I will, I will say that like there were some that I was a little bit nervous about. <laughs> um, and some of them d are not coming back, but some of, some of them are. So there's that, but be fabulous is not coming back, unfortunately. Um, so we do have it in this bar bundle and this is a really pretty kind of grapefruit scent, really fun and citrusy and nice and perfect for the springtime. So be fabulous iridescent pearl this one is kind of a womp for me but it, it was in a really good bundle um this one i i've never i i can't even really smell it on cold <laughs> it's really it's very very light i think what i'll do this will be a bathroom this will be a bathroom scent and i i won't i won't even smell it in the bathroom <laughs> like it, it'll be so light. like that one it's it's so light it's so light okay we have lavender and white balsam i love this one during the holidays this is a great winter scent and not holiday specific like what i love about this is i enjoy this in january even after the holidays because it has that lavender note you do have the tree balsam note so it is giving you the wintry vibes but the lavender is saying you know what it's okay sis like you can warm me after the holidays and it's not christmas specific and so I, I absolutely love that about this particular scent. It is in my club. I love it. Um, having more bars of it is not going to be a bad thing. Make a splash. This was one that I was so afraid was not going to make it back in the spring and summer catalog. Make a splash. 
And spoiler alert, it does make it back for the spring and summer catalog. Thank goodness. <laughs> I was so nervous. I was like, it is in my club. Cause like I've told you, I warned you guys, no scent is safe when it comes to Scentsy saying, hey, we're gonna discontinue this bar. It doesn't always mean that it's gonna come back at any point in time. So, um, so the scents I can't live without are in my club, but um, still I would be super, super sad if this one didn't come back. So make a splash, fantastic, love it. It'll also be back for spring and summer. Okay, we also have Stargazing, which was a scent of the month a while back. Um, this one wasn't, oh, it's not what I was thinking. It's like, it's similar to Jammy Time. This one was a scent of the month. It was a scent of the month. Um, it's not entirely what I was thinking though. I don't know what I was thinking. This is like Jammy Time's cousin. It's very similar to Jammy Time, but has like a little different finish to this. It's nice. This one's gonna go in the bedroom for sure. Really nice. Okay, we also have, have from the Catching Z's Wax Collection, uh, Shut Eye. And this collection was really, really light for me. So this will probably be warmed in like the laundry room or bathrooms or something, but um, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, again, from the Catching Z's Wax Collection, we have Pillow Time, another light scent. <laughs> um, this one's, this one's kind of funky. I don't think it's supposed to smell like that. Let's see here. Yeah, this just, this smells like wax. This doesn't smell like anything. <laughs> I didn't really care for this collection uh, to begin with, and um, I'm still not really caring. It just, it doesn't, it doesn't smell like anything. It just doesn't smell like anything. So there's that. Pristine Waters. Pristine Waters is a good, fresh, clean scent, kind of uh, similar to the Pacific Daydream from earlier. Um, it's aquatic for sure, but you have some kind of woodsy, like beachy elements to this as well, which is really nice. So Pristine Waters. Okay, this I am really excited for. Be My Honey. So I actually got to talking with a couple of friends who are on my team and we got to talking about Buzzworthy because yes, I'm one of the weirdos who loves Buzzworthy. So that got us talking about honey scents. And um, a few of my friends were like, listen, but Be My Honey takes the cake. Like Be My Honey, it's it. that's it. Like that's it. Be My Honey. I remember it was available, but I don't really remember anything about it. So... I have a feeling this is gonna make me really sad <laughs> because these bars we weren't able to add to club. So um, yeah, it just like, we're just gonna have to just warm through this and be sad when it's over. See, I like this, but I still like Buzzworthy better. This is nice though. It is definitely, you get honey and there is a little bit of a floral note to this. It's nice, but I, I don't know, I still, I still love Buzzworthy. Ooh, maybe even mixing this with Buzzworthy would be nice. I'm not going to because um, I'm gonna do my friends a solid <laughs> and I'm gonna enjoy enjoy this as it is and it's tried and true like original form, but it's nice. It's definitely nice. It's not gonna make me like super sad to not be able to add to club, but it's nice. Be my honey. Okay, next one, Sun Soaked Petals. And this one I think is another light one. No, it's not. This one is a really nice, light, springy floral. Yeah, I will definitely enjoy this. This is definitely gonna be in my like spring mix of bars that I enjoy for sure. Nice, there is a little bit of kind of like an earthy green element to this as well. Authentic kind of floral, really nice. So sun-soaked petals. Okay, we also have Midnight in Coratio. This is the one that I always butcher the name of. Um, oh, this, I don't remember this one at all. I know this was available in like a catalog. It wasn't like a, a limited time collection or anything, but it's nice. This is, it's kind of like a spicy berry scent. It's a summertime scent, but there is like some spice to it, like a spicy berry scent. So that's, that's nice. Okay, we also have from the Find Your Happy Wax Collection, First Kiss Fireworks. And this one kind of makes me giggle a little bit because this is the scent 
that when this collection first released, I thought for sure this was going to be like it. Like I thought this was going to be everything for me. And it actually wound up being my least favorite of the collection. <laughs> it's so funny. That's one of the reasons why I really love like when I, uh, when I come on here and I share with you, um, what collections are coming out. I like to make my like judgments just based on like scent descriptions and stuff. Um, and this collection, I was like way off. Like everything was completely opposite of what I expected. So, um, this, I, this doesn't smell like anything. This, this goes into just the wax pile that just smells like wax. <laughs> so there's that. Um, from the Frozen 2 collection, Born to Lead. This one's a really nice fall scent. Um, I think there's apple in here. Yes, this is totally fall, like beginning, beginning of fall scent. It's not too like heavy spicy or anything like that. Um, it's kind of fresh autumn. Um, you get apples from this. It's just, it's very, it's very nice and very like start to fall kind of scent. So nice. Okay. And then we also have from the find your happy wax collection, <laughs> wild barefoot and free. This one I was not anticipating liking here. We were talking, you know, we're going to talk about the find your happy wax collection. What I thought I was going to love, what I thought I was going to hate. Um, I did not think I was going to like this and guess what's in my club. Bink, bink, bink. <laughs> this one's in my club along with showered with flower, showered in flowers. Um, this, and I'm going to say this and people are going to be like, and you like that. <laughs> um, this smells like a bar of soap. <laughs> this totally smells like Irish spring, just straight bar of soap. And I love it. <laughs> I really, really love it. It's very, it's very clean. It's very clean and green. And I am not upset about that. It's fantastic. It's a freaking powerhouse. And I am, I'm here for the strong scents for sure. Okay. The next bar that we have in this haul is peach nectar. And this one's not crazy strong, but, um, uh, this is, it's, it's stronger than it, this is not going to go in just like the wax pile, just the pile that smells like wax. Um, th this is, it's just, it's a light peachy scent. So this one will probably go in, in our bedroom. Really. It's really nice. It's very sweet, juicy. There's no vanilla or anything added. It's just straight peach, which is really nice. Okay. We also have a few more here. We have sand swept another kind of fresh beachy scent to add to the mix with pristine waters and pacific daydream um we have another bar of pink tulips here and i'll give you one guess what it smells like it's a sweet floral yep it's so good <laughs> this is really really nice this will go in my my spring floral bar bundle here okay Ah, uh, yes. Okay. This is going to be one that I'm going to be real sad about not being able to add to club, which means I'm probably going to hang on to it <laughs> and hoard it for no apparent reason, because it doesn't make sense to be hoarding bars and hanging on to them. If you're not going to warm it, you're still not enjoying it, right? I'm trying to get better about that. All you need is love. Oh man, this is such a good scent. I miss this scent. This is coconut. Oh my gosh, do I mean, do you know what I would do to add this to my club? <laughs> this is so dang good. It's so dang good. This is coconut and powdered sugar. There might be some caramel in this too. It's so sweet, but summery. Oh, if you, if you are wondering where I'm going to be, I'm just going to be over here just sticking my face in this clamshell because it's so good. Ah, I love it. All you need is love. I'm really, really happy. I have this. I just need, I just need to be able to warm it and not cry myself to sleep when it's done. <laughs> All right. We have rise and sunshine and this is just a spiced citrus scent. Really nice. If you like Mandarin moon, this is totally like along the same vein. This, these bar bundles are no longer available. So I don't know why I say that, but, um, yeah, it's just, it's a spiced citrus scent. Really, really nice. So there's that. Okay, we have some more here. We have Pretty and Plum. Just a nice plum scent. It's really good. We have Feelin' Punchy, which was from the summer collection last year. I don't care for this. <laughs> um, Sean likes this, so I think this will just go into his office. But um, yeah, this this smells like this smells like Pez. This smells like chalky, citrusy, powdery candy. Not my thing. 
not my thing. Sean loves it. Um, I know some of you love this. This is just not, it, it's, it's a miss for me for that one. Okay, we also have Rosewood and Freesia. I, I don't remember this one, so I'm really excited to sniff this. Oh no, <laughs> this is way, wow. This is very, this is very powdery. Yeah, no. <laughs> okay, I already, I, I have a friend who is going to love this. Um, yeah, this is, no, this is too, too floral for me, too powdery. Um, we have watermelon mint. And this one's a really great one. This is um, a perfect balance between watermelon and just some freshness of mint that's in there, just on the back end that's just adding, like I said, just some freshness which is really nice. Watermelon mint. What else do we have here? Okay, we also have Now and Zen, which is another really nice kind of, um, it's not really, well, I guess, I guess this would be aquatic. It's not beachy. It's definitely spa-like for sure. Like it's giving me spa-like vibes, which is really nice. So Now and Zen. We have Calming Woods. This one was from the Huga wax collection from a few years ago oh yeah i remember this one this one's nice this one will be well this is a good wintry scent for sure um i feel like if we get a really good like dreary kind of snow day here soon we have we still have snow on the ground so uh but it's like really super sunny out and it's like giving me it's still if I'm not going outside because it's 10 degrees, if I'm just staying inside and I see all the sunshine, then I'm like, okay, spring mode. But um, yeah, if it's looking kind of like snowy and stuff outside, I can see myself reaching for this here in the next couple weeks. But other than that, it's this is not gonna be one that I go for towards like the spring and summer months, really. Um, this is more of a wintry scent for me, but really nice. So Calming Woods. Oh, Snapdragon. Talk about a scent that did not come back. It is Oh, Snapdragon. Um, this one's nice. It's it's really light, but I, I can smell it. This is not going to go into just the wax pile. Um, this is just, it's nice. It, this is just kind of a, a fruity scent. Very, very light. So this will either go, this will probably go maybe in here. This is a good room for any like lighter scents because I have more warmers in here than what's totally necessary. So, and it's a smaller room. So this will, this is probably where this is gonna go is in here. Okay, we also have, oh yes, 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 yes. Okay, we have Passion Fruit Colada. I don't remember this one either. So we'll see, we'll see my thoughts here. Oh, it's nice. This is really nice. Why don't I remember this one? Oh yeah, this is totally sweet and fruity. Totally spring and summery. Oh, this is really nice. Gleeful grape, yay. <laughs> Gleeful grape, I don't, I'm not a huge fan of grape scents, but um, thanks to my little Mix With Me series, I have had some people make suggestions about adding uh, graham cracker crunch to give kind of like a peanut butter and jelly kind of vibe, and I think I'm gonna have to do this here. Yep, yep, very grapey. <laughs> Okay, catching Z's. <laughs> we have sleep happy. Let's see, do you smell like more than just wax? Yes, we have a hint. We have a hint of something. This will be a bathroom scent. This is I at least I can smell something. Um this is this is good. Oh. Oh yes, 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 yes. What does this remind me of? It's kind of giving me some medicinal vibes just a little bit. It's softer than just breathe like it's giving me like softer vibes not quite as like medicinal but kind of along the same lines just a little bit just a little softer so catching these okay we have lots of bars here you guys okay plumeria peach oh i love me some plumeria peach this is so so nice this is amazing it is so peachy it is so juicy it is so sweet and i love it so Plumeria peach. Citrus rosemary. This one was actually a spring brick when we had done spring bricks like a while ago. Um, this is a, this is a kitchen scent. Yeah, this is a kitchen scent. Nice and fresh, but definitely like you are smelling that rosemary for sure. The citrus is bright and definitely brings an element to it as well. Definitely good kitchen for sure. Huckleberry and clementine. And this one's good. 
it's sweet and tart, but this is, <laughs> there's a few, there's a few scents that Scentsy makes. This one, and was it vanilla, vanilla blackberry? It was a scent of the month. This one was actually a scent of the month too, like a while back, but it's sweet and tart. <sighs> And it also smells like marijuana. <laughs> it also, I, I get a very green note from this that smells like marijuana to me, just a little bit. So um, Huckleberry and Clementine, we've we've got that for us here. Uh, okay, <clears throat> we have some more bars. Okay, we're, I I can see, I can kind of sort of see near the bottom. So if you're still hanging on with me, thank you, thank you, thank you. I know we had a lot of bars. Okay, and peach and white amber. Oh, this scent. Oh, it's so good. Um, this was actually available in a couple other 10 bar bundles recently, and I did pick up a few there just specifically for this bar because it is just that good. Oh, and I am I'm not sad that I have another bar of this because it's just so dang good, and it'll allow me to enjoy the bars that I have. We also have Quiet Clementine, another one from the Hugga collection, and this one's really nice too. This is a good, this is a good bedroom scent for sure. Quiet Clementine. We have Spring Forward. Add it to the springy floral pile. Ah, it's sweet and it's wonderful. I love it. Okay, we've got a few more here. Oh, a couple of heartbreaks that are not making it back to the spring and summer collection. Pink Sugarberry Mint and Mad for Melon. Pink Sugarberry Mint was a scent of the month that totally blew my mind. Um, this is just a sweet cotton candy scent, and I really am surprised that it didn't make it back to the catalog. Mad for Melon is a, um, is a good melon scent. It's good. <sighs> really good, but it's a little on the lighter side. I can smell it, but it is a little on the lighter side. Okay, we've got some more bars here. We've got two Coastal Strawberry bars. I think there's actually more than, yeah, one, two... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have seven. Okay, you guys know how much I love my coastal strawberry. <laughs> uh, we, I, yes, I have seven. So I, I didn't, I didn't hoard all of all of the coastal strawberries. So don't blame me. But I love this scent so dang much. I love a good strawberry scent. Scentsy does a great strawberry scent. This one is just, this one's just special because this smells like. A good authentic strawberry scent. It's not crazy strong, but in this case, I don't even care. This is just a good sweet strawberry scent, but there is a really pretty green earthy vine note that just makes it even more authentic. And I love it. So we have several coastal strawberry bars because it's just too dang good. So that was obviously not in a bar bundle. Um, okay, then we have Quiet Grove. And this one's nice. It's a little bit, it's a, it's a little different for me. It's woodsy, but there is kind of like, is there a lemon in here too? It's woodsy and lemon. It's, but there's like kind of a different note in here that I don't, I'm not crazy about. It's good. I'm not crazy about it, but it's good. Inhale, exhale. I do really like this one. This is um, actually kind of a salty citrus scent. This one was a scent of the month and this one was really nice. I thought it was paired perfectly with our Himalayan salt warmers, which were the warmers of the month. Um, I, I felt like that that pairing was like perfect. Um, but yeah, so I really enjoyed this. So inhale, exhale. We also have pineapple pucker. Perfect for spring and summer for sure. It's just straight pineapple. There's no coconut. There's no nothing else. It's just pineapple. It's fantastic. So love that. Okay, the last few bars we have here, uh, we have Jewel Pomegranate, oh, heartbreak. Okay, so Jewel Pomegranate hasn't been around um, in the wax, but unfortunately we are ooh, doing away with Jewel Pomegranate in the body line, which really breaks my heart. Um, it's great, it's great in the wax, but man, it is just, it's a whole different story in the body line and I'm so super sad that we're getting rid of it. Uh, lavender cotton, got a good lavender laundry kind of scent. Fantastic, love it, nice and strong. Aloe vera and ivy. And this one's a, another just fresh, clean, um, fresh, clean scent. Really nice. 
And then one more, because why not? <laughs> coastal strawberry. <laughs> one more coastal strawberry to add to my strawberry patch over here. All right, that is it. Woo, I got a slew of bars to put away. That is my flash sale haul. Again, if you have not received your flash sale order just yet, not to worry, Sensi is still working on those orders and getting them out to you. Um, it can take up to 21 business days to get your orders to you. So thank you, thank you, thank you for your patience. Um, I cannot wait to hear about and see what you guys snagged during the flash sale because man, those deals were absolutely incredible. All right, you guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like this type of content. If you're new, please subscribe. If you're already subscribed, be sure to hit the notification bell. That way you stay up to date with all things Sensi. All right, I've got my fair share of work here to put away. I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.